Welcome to new and exciting changes in Unreal Engine 5.3. Now, landscape supports Nanite and displacement is back. Everything can be done in real time. You can download any material you want from Quixel Bridge, create a new material, add the texture with the displacement, and create a Nanite landscape. Today I'll be showing you how you can do all this stuff step by step with few clicks. Before I explain anything, some people cannot see the displacement here after creating a new material, but don't worry, it's actually pretty easy to fix. All you have to do is go to your Unreal Engine 5 folder and then go to config, default engine, scroll down to render settings, there we go, and then you will see that these two options are not available in your default engine. So I'm going to add these to the description so you can only copy and paste them, but don't forget to copy and paste them directly under the render settings. Ctrl S, close this, go back here, restart your engine, go back to the new material you created and you will see this option. First, go to selection mode, go to landscape and then hit create landscape. After you're done, go back to selection, then right click here. Add Quixel content. I'm gonna go to my local and then I'm gonna choose a material. I'm gonna take this rocky ground, which you can use, or you can use any other material. And I'm gonna choose the highest quality and I'm gonna add this to my Unreal Engine 5. Now I'm gonna head to my Mega Scans, Surfaces, Rocky Ground, and then I'm gonna right click, New Material. To double click here and then I'm gonna choose these three textures connect the base color to the base color the normal to the normal and then this one uh, connect it here and then this one to roughness and finally displacement apply and now if you press on that you go down you see here displacement, magnitude, center. I'm gonna put this to 0, 0.0, let's say five, and then I'm gonna apply this and close this. I needed to do a small thing so we can let the landscape have a displacement in it. So enter console command here. I'm gonna need you to copy and paste again at these two but without the equal only space so I'm gonna just control C control V and then hit enter and then I'm gonna control C this one and control V this one and hit enter again and after I activate this I'm gonna go and select my landscape go up drag and drop this to landscape material you can still not see uh, displacement that's because we did not enable the nanite enable nanite and then build data. Now you can see we have a displacement on landscape. Finally, this is back. Don't forget that if we want to apply a new material to this, for example, I created my own new material. Let's say this example here. I'm going to have to go in and rebuild data again and if you want to make it easier for you you can just go to your material oh there it is and then convert to parameters let's name this as base and that one also normal and this one this displacement displacement and now after I apply this and then I go here I'm gonna create a material instance go back here drag and drop rebuild so this is better because if you want to create a, so you don't have to actually create a new material you just go here Go to Mega Scan Surfaces Construction. Oh, sorry. Activate these three, and just drag and drop base to base. 
you can see normal to normal and displacement to displacement that would be easier for you don't forget that you can also tweak the displacement by going to the material and then go to the uh, material here and then click here go down and then you can probably put 0 0.6 apply and you can see we have more displacement here so I hope you enjoy this tutorial and I really hope you make uh, a good things out of this and see you in the next one